Hi everyone! Welcome back to another My Time at Porsche Let's Play. I'm really excited to keep playing and I hope you enjoyed the last video. If you haven't watched it already, I'll link it in the description below. But yeah, let's just get started and carry on our adventure in Porsche, I guess. Let's go! <sighs> well, good morning! Good morning everyone, let's get up and start doing our chores, I guess. First of all, I want to fix the holes in this house because I'm not getting a good enough sleep and um, I need to fix it. Yes, please. Let's try fix all the holes today. Free wood. Okay, I have enough. Oh, no, I don't. <laughs> I guess let's go collect some. Oh, it's a cloudy day today. It's a bit dark and gloomy, isn't it? Oh, I've got a letter. Let's go see what it is. From Civil... Oh my god, I've got so many! Hi Builder, I just want to inform you that the Civil Corps of Portia can take some commissions from you when it comes to gathering materials from dangerous ruins. You can post the commission on our commission board in the Civil Corps building in the northern end of town. Okay, okay. Hey Builder, at the end of the week, we need qualified people to inspect these products. To coordinate with this, we will not be posting any regular commission. Okay. Hey new builder, I have a man- Manly? I'm a woman. <laughs> uh, macho quality? This is rude. Who is this person? I don't even know who they are. And they're asking for macho quality blades? Okay. I'm excited to meet this character, whoever he is. Okay, so I wonder what we should do today. First of all, we have to collect lots of materials because I want to fix the holes in our house the most. Because then maybe we can start decorating the house. This game, there's a lot of walking around and gathering things. And there's also a lot of, like, just, like, running around and not really know what, what I'm doing. Because <laughs> I'm not the best at keeping track of the quests I'm, I've said I do. And, yeah, I'm not the best at it. That's why some bits are cut out. But it's such a relaxing game, like, it doesn't really matter if you cut parts out because it's still so relaxing just to watch. Also, I'm never going to get used to those pink llamas, they're so cute. <laughs> Look at them. I could watch them all day. Oh, and I never get used to this poo either. <laughs> okay, so I need to craft a wooden bridge. I think I need the body and the head. But this notebook is so confusing, like, trying to figure out the things I need. I'm not sure how I get any of these things. I think I might have to go mining to get all of this stuff, to be honest. Which means we'll probably be doing some mining today, I guess. Okay, so... Oh my god, I can do a flip! What the heck? <laughs> what the heck? Okay, let's get some wood. Yeah. Oh, I leveled up. Yay! I really like leveling up in this game. Okay, let's fix more holes in the house. Because if you don't fix them, your character wakes up with less health than they should. And it's quite annoying. Because it means you can't do as much in the day. Yes, please. Oh, I don't have enough for this one. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, who's Sophie? Hello. Emily loves my home cooking. Maybe you can come over for dinner. I mean, who's Emily? Oh, look, a duck. There's Karyum. He's so cute. Wait, what's, why's the music changed? Huh? Oh my God, I'm being attacked. No, 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 no. I've played enough Skyrim to know where this is going. No! Run away! <laughs> Guys, never pick up a duck. Ever. Don't ever touch a duck. They will attack you. And you will die. Oh. Audit. Audit? I don't know how to pronounce. Oh, you're new in town. I just moved here a little while ago. Name's Audit? Oh, he's cute. I love life here in Portia. It's really peaceful and relaxing. Me too, buddy. It's nice, isn't it? 
Oh, so here's my friendship level for the characters. What I've learnt from this is nobody likes me. <laughs> Just like in real life. Okay, so let's go. Oh, what's this? Kiwa? Fisherman, one of the Hulu brothers. Hey there, I'm Kiwa, the smallest of the Hulu brothers. There are seven of Seven? Oh my gosh. I've been around and the fishing around Porsche is just the best. So many spots to go fishing and the fish are oh so tasty. Oh, that's cute. What's this? Hey, you're the new builder, right? I'm well, I know, you already introduced yourself. <laughs> Broke my fishing rod. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to make him a new fishing rod, I guess. First, I want to place this, though. Let's see, I want it right here, please. Yes. Yay! I don't even know what it's for, though. <laughs> Let's see if I can craft a fishing rod, I guess. Sword axe. I actually need a bronze axe to get hardwood to build the bridge. But I need bronze bars for the bronze axe, which I need to go mining for, so, yep, I definitely need to go mining in this episode. It looks like I need... Yep, I need to go mining for the fishing rod as well. So, yeah, I guess let's go mining, I guess. But first I've got to do... First I've got to build my bridge. Looks like I need to go mining for everything. <laughs> I'll just leave it there for now. And then we'll come back and build it later. Oh my god, but it's already so late. I guess we have to go to bed now. Wait, change colour? Oh, I can have a pink bed. Please can I have a pink bed. Please. It's so cute now. Yes, please. Can I confirm? Oh, fine. I'll just go to sleep in my cream bed. My boring cream bed. <laughs> Well, good morning, good morning, good morning. Let's fix the whole my house today. Maybe because you didn't do it yesterday. Oh, he's still outside my house. I guess he really wants that fishing rod, huh? Oh, look, it's Pinky. Hi. I'm really sorry for giving you a caterpillar yesterday. I'm not gonna give you a gift today because I don't have anything that'll make you love me. Let's go explore and find the mines. Yeah. I hope I have enough money. I don't even know how much money I have in this. Yes, please. Okay, so I'm in the mines now. The music is really cool in here. So what you have to do is you have to scan the room and find things hidden in the stone. And once you've scanned them, then you can quit scanning. And then you... Oh. <laughs> I guess I have to use my pickaxe. Um, and then you can mine through the stone and find whatever it is. That's what I think you have to do anyway. Oh, I got some sand. And it tells you how many meters away you are from the thing, so you just keep digging basically until you get to it. There's probably going to be a lot of times in this game where we're just mining, so there might be a lot I have to cut out in some days while we're playing. Because it's not that fun to watch, is it? But let's see what we can get. Maybe I should go ask the research centre. Oh, okay. Well, I'll do that afterwards, but I need to find some more things first. Let's go over here. Dig and dig. I've just got that song from Frozen in my head. You know the... Oh, the Moses... Mountain rain combining... Oh. What is this? I remember Remington mentioning something about this. Something about talking... Oh, I didn't get to read it. Something about the church, I think it said. So I guess we'll go to the research centre and the church after this. Monument model piece? Hmm. Let's see. Where can I go next? Yay, I leveled up! That's so good, right? Two levels in one playthrough. <laughs> I'm not sure what leveling up does for you though. Wait, why is this like just hanging on a string? Huh? Oh, I don't have enough inventory space. 
Okay, let's get rid of some stuff from my pockets. I guess I'll get rid of the poo because I probably need that the least. <laughs> All of it, please. I'm sorry, poo, but we have to say goodbye. Ugh, that's nasty. <laughs> oh, a chest. What's in it this time? Oh. Oh my god, I don't have enough inventory again. <laughs> oh, that's annoying. I guess let's get rid of some stuff. Goodbye, kite spillers. Dooby dee. Oh, what's this over here? Lee wants something. Good day, builder. Oh dear, a data disk. You know what this is? Of course, this is what the ancients used to store information on their technologies back in the age of corruption. It's highly dangerous because there's a chance this little item here could contain the blueprint for world destruction. What? It can't be that bad, right? Haha, <laughs> you're what? 18? <gasps> Actually, contrary to popular belief, I turned 20 last month, so... I know, right, with this high-pitched voice? <laughs> I have what a rude thing to say. Just because I'm younger doesn't mean I know less. First um, She went days about food every day for each other the most basic of things. And people were considered, oh... That's what the end of the world looked like. That situation was created by the very same sort of dark technology stored in this disc. Am I the only one that thinks he's lying? Anyhow, I'm not trying to scare you, but it's the reality of the builder business. Dangerous technologies are spread all over the world, waiting to be stumbled upon and rediscovered. Places like the research centre and cities like Vega 5 expedite their recovery. Calamity will strike again, mark my words. I don't trust him. I think he's a liar. I think he just wants people to love the church. And he's too worried. I think he's just worried that the world's going to end because of technology. And he's taking my disc. I didn't want to give it to him. I'd rather give it to the research centre because I bet they're nicer. Oh, wait, he's going to give me things. I mean, maybe... Uh... Oh, he's giving me seeds, but I don't know how to farm. No, I don't know. You should ask your neighbour, Emily, about how to farm. Here, I'll take that disc and give you some seeds to get you started. Who's Emily? Everyone keeps mentioning her. I've never even seen her once. Oh, my inventory is too full again. <laughs> this is so annoying. Oh, who's this? Hello, I just wanted to say now that you're here, we can't play hide and seek in that haunted house anymore. It's all your fault. I mean... That's rude. I wonder where Molly will go today. Wherever she goes, I go as well. Teehee. Ah, oh, I remember being that age and having your best friend. Oh, she's cute. Hello. What do we have here? A data disc. You know what it is? You want to know? This is actually related to how you can discover new diagrams for your workshop handbook. We rely on relic components from the past to build a lot of our current constructs. Many relics in this world are beyond our current understanding and you won't be able to build them not even in a hundred years that's where this data disk comes in these data disks are located all around the world they hold lots of useful information on the old relics if you find any give them to us and we'll give you research into these relics the research effort will produce the diagrams that you need to build them we're not miracle workers so don't expect us to come up with things from scratch but we do know a thing or two about how it works anyway just remember that if you find any data disks bring them to me See, look how much nicer she was than that other guy. You're new, aren't you? Are you lost or something? I love his uh, goggles. <laughs> People in church are so stubborn. Why shouldn't we use technology from the old world? They obviously can make our lives more convenient. Doesn't make any sense. Mmm, I agree. What is Molly she was talking about? Hi, where are you from? She seems nicer than that other girl. All my clothes were handmade by my- <gasps> Clothes? Where? Where can I get these clothes? A clothes shop! Oh, it's shut. God damn it, I guess we'll go next time. <laughs> oh, who's this? I've never seen her before. <gasps> Ginger! Wait, isn't that... Isn't she related to the mayor? Oh, she's so sweet. I love her. Oh my god, what is that? Is that... Is that a bear? Is that a bear and a dressing girl? <laughs> 
Ah, oh, my exact reaction to seeing you. You are so cute. I'm gonna cry. I love bears so much. He's so cute. Why is he here? Why is he in a dressing gown? Oh, my exact reaction. I love you so much. Please, let's be best friends. You're so cute. I just want to give you a big fuzzy hug. How is there a bear walking around? I don't get it. And look at him. Oh my gosh. What is that? I love it so much. Oh, little dancing ladybugs. I love them. Oh my god, I still don't have enough inventory space. Ah, why? Oh look, panda bats. Okay guys, I'm going to build a storage box because I literally can't take this anymore. Every time I pick up something, I don't have enough space for it. Yes, please. Oh my god. I don't have enough space for the inventory box. This is the most frustrating thing. Okay, so I'm going to place the box now. I actually managed to get rid of some things. It was a miracle. Yes, please. Now I can finally put things in here. Hopefully, and have more space. <laughs> and I want to place this on the wall. Yay! Oh my god, look, it's Mr. Bear again. Oh, and he's with Oaks. I think it said they were related. Oh, I love how they're just chilling by the river. They're so cute. Hello. I guess that's all he says. I don't mind, though, because I love him. Yay, I leveled up again. I'm just trying to get stuff to uh, build more stuff, I guess. Look how pretty this is. This game is gorgeous. Oh my god, what are they? Sea urchins, they're so cool with little umbrellas. Oh my god, what? No! <laughs> no! They're attacking me! Why is everything attacking me in this playthrough? <laughs> what the heck? Ah, oh, back with my happy llamas again. Wait. Why is the panda bat attacking me? I don't understand. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, hello. Hi there, I haven't seen you around. Where are you from? It's beautiful outside the town, right? Little fe little, f little fellow. I'm a girl. Whoa, look at the sky, guys. So pretty and pink. I feel like I just point out everything that's pink in this game because it's my favourite colour. But it's so beautiful, right? I love the clouds. I'm back mining now because I'm really just trying to collect materials to build stuff. I'm not really sure how to collect it. I think if I just keep mining, I can find the right stuff. And uh, mining stone outside as well. Oh, hello. Is my fishing rod done? I'm so hung- Oh my god, he's starving to death because I haven't made his fishing rod. I'm sorry! Well, I guess that's it for now, guys. I'm sorry nothing much happened in today's playthrough. But there wasn't much to do today. It was really just farming, like, it was really just mining stuff and collecting bits and bobs to build stuff. But hopefully next time we can collect enough stuff to actually build the bridge and see what happens next in the main story. Maybe we can even get the fishing rod built if I collect as much stuff as I need. i fix the holes in my house too. Yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoy the series. And I hope you enjoy this episode. I promise the next one will be more interesting. I'm sorry this one was a bit boring. Oh, please like and subscribe. Only if you want to though. But thank you all so much for supporting me and my channel and my videos. And I'll see you all in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!